I'm David Rubin. I'm the Section Chief of Gastroenterology, Hepatology, and Nutrition at the University of Chicago. I'm also an alum of our training program. The University of Chicago struck me from the day I arrived as a unique place. I had looked at a lot of different programs, and what I knew when I interviewed was that this was a place that not only provided me with the opportunity to become an outstanding physician, which of course was core to who I was, but also would train me to be a critical thinker, to advance the field, to ask questions and challenge status quo. And in fact, that's exactly what happened in my training and subsequently. Hi, uh, my name is Andrew Aronson. I'm an Associate Professor of Medicine at the University of Chicago, and I am the Program Director for the GI Fellowship. We're a very special program because we can offer a tremendous amount to our fellows. First is clinical training. We have great clinical training in all aspects of gastroenterology. Um, the second thing is research. We have a tremendous amount of research opportunities, both clinical, basic science, translational. Um, all of our fellows can uh, match up with mentors and have great research experiences during fellowship. And we train you to be leaders within academic medicine and within gastroenterology with other opportunities that we have within our fellowship. Hi, I'm Matt Odenwald. I'm one of the second year GI fellows. There's so much to like about working at the University of Chicago. One of the things I like most is that everything is on one campus. Your inpatient and outpatient rotations are all on one campus, and it makes a seamless transition from rotating on inpatient to making it to outpatient clinic. Uh, my name is Anjana Palai. I'm a transplant hepatologist here. I'm an associate professor of medicine, and I direct our liver tumor program, and I'm also the program director of the Transplant Hepatology Fellowship. The University of Chicago has one of the oldest and most innovative trans liver transplant programs in the country. We, in fact, did the very first living donor liver transplant in the world of a young woman um, whose uh, mo mother was her donor. The Center for Care and Discovery, which is our main hospital on the Hyde Park campus, opened in 2013. We had direct say in the design of this hospital, and when we designed the endoscopy suites, we had a separate area for general GI endoscopy and an entire area dedicated to interventional endoscopy and on-site cytopathology. All the rooms in our hospital are private, and we actually have our own units for certain elements of our care, including transplant and inflammatory bowel disease. We're very proud of what this hospital offers in terms of state-of-the-art care. I'm Dr. Ed McDonald. I'm assistant professor of medicine, one of the gastroenterologists, also the associate director of adult nutrition. I'm a trained chef, and I'm the director of diversity for graduate medical education. I love teaching the fellows, and one of the reasons why I love teaching the fellows is because I actually remember what it felt like to be a fellow. So I remember doing colonoscopies, and I remember being bad as a first year. I remember being frustrated and feeling like, why am I not as good as I should be? And, and, and I felt like, like that was, that's a natural experience for a first year fellow. And for me, I didn't really have any attendings to say like, it's okay, like the sequel will come. I, I, I initially felt like I was struggling. Uh, so when I see first year fellows going through the same things that I experienced, I can identify with that feeling. Hi, I'm Jenny Wang, one of the third year GI fellows at the University of Chicago. So working closely with some of the world-renowned hepatologists and nutrition faculty really helped me gain knowledge that can only be um, gained through experience and they're tremendously accessible. Um, I have cell phone numbers of every single attending I work with and I never felt uncomfortable calling them in the middle of the night if needed. Um, I really think the best part of the fellowship is the people. Um, I have always felt supported by my attendings, by co-fellows and the support staff. I'm Sonia Kupfer. I'm an associate professor in the section of gastroenterology, hepatology, and nutrition at the University of Chicago and also associate section chief for education. So one of the really unique things about the University of Chicago section of GI hepatology and nutrition is that we have a very active women's committee and actually women represent 50% of our faculty. Uh, as an example, we have a women's conference that has been going on now for a couple of years, going into its third year, and is really focused on women and digestive diseases, both from a medical perspective, but also for career development. What makes us really unique is that we are a small, tight-knit family. You'll know all the faculty really well, uh, and we'll be able to individualize training in a way 
that gets you to your goal. So we realize that not one size fits all. So we'll see what your interests are, what goals you want to achieve throughout fellowship and beyond, and we'll make it so you have the training program to get you there. So in the next five years, we're actually expecting a significant growth in what we do clinically. And of course, that includes what we do from a research and training point of view. It's an exciting time to be at the University of Chicago. It's a perfect time for you to come and join us and to be one of our trainees and join the University of Chicago family.